Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your daily vibes for Friday, June 15th. This is for all signs. Daily energy, Friday, June 15th. Daily energy. We have the Empress. This is a rebirth. This could be a pregnancy. This could be some sort of healing that is going on within you. This is, um, it's all about love. We have the Ace of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords. There's an opportunity, a new opportunity coming in um, that is very loving, very compassionate. You could be receiving a new opportunity that is very stable and secure, but you fear, you know, what's up? What's up? What's up with this? This is, is this too good to be true? What the hell is this? Yeah, you lack faith in this situation, this new opportunity. I feel like there is a new opportunity being offered to you that is that it, that could be stable and secure. Now, this could be a job, this could be a partnership, this could be this could even be a gift. Whatever this is, you're being given something very prominent that you've manifested. Okay, you've manifested it. This is being given to you because you have been through some serious life lessons and you've gained a lot through those life lessons. So it's like the universe is giving you your reward, but it feels as though you don't trust this. You don't trust this new opportunity. You don't trust this new offer that you're receiving. Okay, you don't. There's a lack of trust. There's a lack of faith in it. You feel like, you know, somebody is, some, what's going on? What's going on behind the scenes? We have the Seven of Swords. What is, what's up here? There's something going on. There's some sort of sneaky business, shady shit. What is this? Nine of Wands reversed. Somebody is has given up, I think, given up on love. Somebody has given up on love. But there's a new opportunity coming in. There's a new opportunity being offered to you, but you're afraid. You're afraid of being deceived. You're afraid of being lied to. You're afraid of being cheated. Therefore, you don't trust. You don't trust, I don't trust, even though there's a new opportunity. And this is something that you can touch. This is, this is something you can touch. It's your reward. This is your reward. This is some of you are receiving your reward. Because of all the battles you've been through. Somebody has been through some serious battles, some serious life battles, okay? With the emperor mirroring this 9 of wands, it's like it's over. This difficult period in your life is over. You've learned from it. You you have, you've learned from this situation. And it's really built your character. It has. But it's also made you put your guard up. It has. It's made you put your guard up because you feel like you can't trust. Like, I can't because you will, you will just deceive me if I do. Interesting. Yeah, you're being called to focus on the future. The Three of Wands realize your goals and maybe that's what this is maybe you have finally realized your goals maybe you have finally decided to let yourself heal from this past hurt to give up on the past to give up on whatever it was you know the nine of pentacles reversed the three of cups the nine of cups and the page of cups yeah there's a new offer here for somebody there's a new offer of love it's it is it's 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 coming in it looks like it could lead to something stable and secure, but your your past experiences with the Nine of Wands reversed is saying, you know, can you trust? 
can you let this person in? You know, can you give this, can you, can you give this a whirl? Um, you know, I feel like whatever this opportunity is, it could affect your singlehood. It could, it could affect your independence. You know, maybe, maybe you, you have learned to love yourself with this rebirth, this uh, Empress card. You've learned to love yourself on your own. You've learned from your experiences. You're doing quite well. You're very abundant in your own right. You know, you've gained a lot of strength and compassion through some suffering. You've gained a lot of wisdom, okay? And you've realized what your goals are with the Three of Wands underneath it. You've realized what they are. You're prepared for a better future. You're working on yourself. You've healed. You've gone through a some sort of um, rebirth, okay? So you're doing really good. You're doing really good. All of a sudden, the universe offers you this new exciting opportunity, okay? It's a really good opportunity. It's something that you've manifested with this with this Ace of Pentacles right next to the Empress card. You've done your work. You, you've healed. You're doing great. You're on cloud nine, okay? Now you get offered this new opportunity of stability and security. And the fact of the matter is, is this new opportunity of stability and security is probably going to affect your independence, Okay, it is. It's going to affect your independence. And, you know, you may be feeling like you're, you're, you're really scared to, to let go of this independence. Okay, you're, you're, you are. You're scared of this independence. And so, you know, in the past, you've been cheated. You've been lied to. You feel like you've been robbed. And you've learned from those experiences. Okay? And now you're, you're really afraid of getting involved with anybody that could involve you in a third party situation or you're, in, you're, you're really afraid to uh, let somebody in to um, have fun with, okay? I feel as though there is an opportunity that is coming in that could be love, okay? It could be love, could lead to stability and security, but your own fears from your past experiences of being cheated and deceived are holding you back. And I think that, you know, for some of you, that's that's your ego, your ego, because we have the Nine of Cups here, your ego uh, fears are, you're trying to protect your fears, you're trying to protect your heart, you're trying to protect your soul by, by keeping your guard up from anybody really coming in and offering you any love. I feel as though you're, some of you are afraid of commitment with that Hierophant card reverse. Somebody is really afraid to commit to to anything so you may be you know out there having fun and dating and as you're because we have the three of cups here you could be dating and 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 find out that you end up um falling for somebody that you were weren't planning on falling for okay so just beware if you know if that's the case it feels as though wish fulfillment is coming it's your reward it's something that you've earned it's it's something that um, you've manifested. It's something that you really are, have been getting prepared for, okay? You have. It's like your ships are finally coming to come in after a period of struggle. And I feel as though whatever this is, it is absolutely going to affect your independence and perhaps it's not what you were looking for. You know, I feel like there's a new opportunity coming in that you didn't expect you totally didn't expect and you and you feel as though you know I'm not sure that you're telling me the truth you know you've been lied to so many times and it feels as though somebody lacks faith and trust and even having any kind of relationship at this time but but it feels like it could happen whether whether you like it or not there could also be some sort of reconciliation here Somebody, somebody could be coming in that you have been wanting to come back, okay? There could be a, a reunion, okay? Somebody could be coming back that you have been waiting for. You've manifested it, you know? They've healed, you've healed, and, and the time is now, okay? Because I can see that somebody's, somebody's ships are finally coming in, okay? Somebody has, there's been a lot of growth, okay? There's been a lot of growth within you and, and another person. So I feel like somebody has been feeling really like, you know what, I don't want to be alone anymore. I don't want to be alone anymore. So I am going to go offer this this new opportunity to this person that 
that I love. So I feel like there is a there is a reconciliation or a reunion for some of you. I'm not sure who this is for, but it's after some sort of betrayal. There could have been some cheating. There could have been a third party situation, or there just or it could have just been lies. Okay. And there could have been, I think there was a, a per, at least for somebody watching this, somebody in your dynamic was afraid of commitment. They were. They were afraid of commitment. Their ego was in the way. They needed attention from others. They needed a lot of attention. You know, that's what the ego does. The ego needs attention. And I feel like now this person um, is is no longer letting that, that old them um be the dominant be the dominant factor in, in what their wish fulfillment is i feel like there is a new offer of love coming in in which you have really waited a long time for and it feels like your past wounds are may be holding you back from accepting it or you may feel because i see the wounds i see that you've been really wounded by somebody and that's why i feel like this could be a reconciliation i mean i see another i see a few reconciliation cards but anyway there there could be a reconciliation with someone but you may feel like you know i i'm not sure that i can trust you at all at this point i'm not sure that i can trust you but it's you also feel deep down that this is what you want so this is very confusing and i know that it is so i feel as though for some of you because this is for hundreds and thousands of people you're out there you're having fun you are enjoying life you are moving on and and as you move on you know and you you may not be wanting a commitment. You may be wanting to work on yourself, thinking, you know, everything is great. I'm, I'm healing. I'm very abundant with who I am. And then all of a sudden, somebody somebody comes in and, and changes the plan. So I feel like that's what this is, that I feel like there's a new opportunity that comes in very unexpectedly. Because that page of cups is a message that comes unexpectedly of love. And it's something you really want deep down. It's something you've been wishing for. But, you know, on the surface, you don't. So deep down, you want it. But on the surface, you don't want it. On the surface, you're happy, you're abundant, you're healing, you're going through a renewal, you know, the whole nine yards. You're, you know, but then deep down, this is something that you really want. You really do want this offer of love. So I feel as though, you know, today is a day you could receive some sort of message that leads you down a new path that you weren't planning on going down. Okay. So, yeah, that's what I see. Um, I'm sorry that this is on my iPhone. I woke up this morning to no internet um, because apparently the one that I kicked out decided to, he couldn't wait until um, mine was turned on. So mine is going to be turned on between 10, 10 and 12, and I'll go back to my to my normal um, routine. This is my fourth try with this reading. So because of the phone, it just threw me off. I In the other one, I could see that somebody was bitter, somebody was angry, and they're angry with your happiness. They're angry that you moved on. So for some of you, somebody is not happy that you have moved on, and they're acting out of um, a resentful state. Okay, and I had the Queen of Swords reversed on top of it was the Emperor reversed. That's angry and bitter. Okay, so somebody is angry and bitter that somebody has moved on from a from them. Okay, so they're so they're taking a vindictive approach. Um, so that could certainly be a factor in your life. I also feel like. Um, Somebody is holding on to the past. In one of the readings that I did, somebody is really holding on. They haven't let go. We had the death card reversed. You know, they're unable to let go of, of a situation that, that um, they want to revive, okay? They want to revive a situation. They they do. So they you could be getting a message from somebody that they want to revive what they once had from you. I'm not sure what this is, but that was part of the message. Um... So yeah, I think this is a very confusing day. I feel like there's a lot of mixed energies. Um, I feel that somebody is is trying to move on from a situation, but they can't. Um, they've been reluctant to move on. 
and therefore they may be, you know, deciding that it's time to to bring the stability and the security back to their life and, and send that message of love to whoever it is. And I'm not sure, you know, what this is, but I feel as though somebody's done a lot of healing. They've done a lot of inner work and now now they're about to receive their prayers. It's I mean their aunt yeah. I, I was I didn't mean to say prayers, that's what came out of my mouth. The answer to their prayers, I was gonna say reward. But then prayers came out. So it's like the answer to their prayers. It's like, but these are their, their hidden prayers. Okay? It's their, their hidden prayers. It's not, you know, on the surface, you, you're, you are saying something else. But down below, deep down, you're wanting something different. You know, it's, that's what's going on here. Somebody is, is hiding their true feelings. So anyway, that's what I have for today. <clears throat> I know it's not a clear message. This whole phone thing is very uh, crazy. So it's not usual. It's not my usual thing. So I'm not sure I'm even going to post this. I may just wait and do the do the, the daily vibe uh, later. I am the queen of pentacles, which you guys have all heard many times. I like consistency. <laughs> <laughs> I do, I do. Change is rough. Change is, I'm Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Change is rough. So this is rough for me. You know, I've been struggling with it, but it's just like, oh my God, I can't believe you did this to me. So, but karma is a bitch, okay? It really is. If you can't be kind, if you can't be nice, be prepared to get it back. Be prepared, okay? So, anyway, um... I wish you the best, and I will probably do another Daily Vibes after the internet is turned back on here within no time. Talk to you later.